Over the next 10 days, I'm doing a simple one tip a day video. Check back tomorrow for another. Now listen, I know that Thingiverse isn't the flavour of the month at the moment. I think we're all annoyed with them to be honest, but there's still stuff on there that we need. And so this is still relevant and probably will be as everything calms down and we all forget about the event. Yes, sadly, I've been on the planet long enough to realise that nothing is going to change and Thingiverse is going nowhere. Call me cynical, but... I guess we'll see, won't we? But that is not what I want to talk about. What I want to talk about is this customizer they have on there. It's not been terribly successful, I don't think. At least I've not found it very good myself, but there is a way around it. You see, it appears that these customizer models on Thingiverse do not need Thingiverse to customize. You can use OpenSCAD. If you haven't come across it, it's kind of like a CAD but really strange because you have to code the shapes and you know the the, the yeah mmm. OpenSCAD is something I want to look at more in the future including actually learning it because I've hardly used it but you don't really need to be familiar with it to use it in this manner. You have to render your part after you've made any adjustments. You just go to Design Render, or you can press F6, and you'll get a chime when it's done, but you still need to save it. This is done via Export to STL. There are also models that aren't customizer models, but occasionally you'll see someone provides a SCAD file, and you should always download this and use it, because you can open it and similarly change parameters in the code. It's usually not hard to figure out, it depends how well it's coded, but the worst case is you have to mess about blindly until you get what you want. That's about all you need to know to use the customizer. If you want to know more about OpenSCAD, then don't ask me. Not yet, at least. Come back tomorrow for the next tip. Thank you for watching.